So if you never tried Korean beauty before, you want a really simple routine, this is how you start. K-Beauty is iconic for the double cleanse. Number one cleansing oil in K-Beauty is the Anua cleansing oil. This is the cleansing oil that draws all the sebum out. The white dot is a sebaceous filament. It draws it all out, keeping your nose really clean. After doing it for about 60 seconds, you have to emulsify it with water, wash it off completely, and go in with a water-based cleanser. This is the best one for pores. No pore deep cleansing foam. Gets into all those chin pores. Clean your pores from inside out. Use this heart leaf powder. Creates really dense bubbles like the ones you see on my face right now. Dense bubbles are able to foam into your pores. Helps to gently clear all the impurities from your pores. This is the cleanser that always makes my skin feel really clean. You have to wash it away with water again. And then completely dry your skin. Cleanser is perfect for those with sensitive skin. The main ingredient is heart leaf. Leaves your skin feeling really clean but not tight. Korean Beauty, my favorite way to exfoliate is using toner pads. This is Cellimax BHA toner pads. One of the most popular toner pads in Korea. Two sides. It has a gauze side and a smooth side. For skin, you should always use the smooth side because you don't want to damage your barrier. The gauze side might be too harsh for some skin types. This is the perfect exfoliation if you have textured skin. How I use the gauze side. So I use the gauze side behind my ears because behind the ears is the sebum zone. Use it to purify the back of my ears. Sometimes the gauze pad turns yellow. That's all sebum. Then I go in with 